right back with a free agent spotlight. I told you guys we was gonna do it again with another Oakland Raider. Today we're talking about Jordy Nelson. I'm gonna tell you why Jordy Nelson may can help the Detroit Lions out. Blessings to the brothers and sisters out there supporting the channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, bell icon button. It's more to see sports talk if you don't know. Now you know it's your boy CJ Goodfellow. And Jordy Nelson will be 34, May 31st this year. Um, let's just say hypothetically uh, that the Lions wanted to move Marvin Jones. Let's see, he say he was one of those veterans that revolted against Matt Patricia. And he wants to make it a Patriot Way locker room guy or he want to get rid of the bad apples. Now, I'm not saying that Marvin Jones is one of those guys, but it's a high possibility it could be. But he's still a highly talented guy. Still fairly young. Had a knee injury in camp. Never thought he was 100% last year. Went down with a knee injury and his season ended. But I still like him in uh, Galladay as one, two. And I still like Powell and Amendola working in the middle of the field. Now, let's say they wanted to move Marvin Jones. And, uh, you know, bring a younger receiver in there at a later date and they need to plug or somebody got injured um, or they just wanted to, you know, Jordy Nelson is affordable. Why not bring in Jordy Nelson? You know what I'm saying? Older guy, but he's still formidable last year. It wasn't his fault performance wise why he dropped off. It was that Derek Carr, you know, you know, just wasn't on point last year. You know, Jordy Nelson has some good games still and he got a little juice left in him. I know I've been saying that, um, you know, younger and faster is the way to go. And I agree. But, you know, if somebody get injured, you know, um, you know, Nelson can play the slot, you know. Uh, so he brings a lot to the table, a lot to the table. He can play outside. He can help Matthew Stafford kind of show some things that him and Aaron Rodgers did. But this is really contingent on if they were to lose a receiver, a receiver go down, or they trade Marvin Jones, they need a replacement, something like that. Right now, they set a receiver, Galladay, Jones, um, Powell, Amendola. They could use a fifth one, but I think Jordy Nelson will instantly start in the slot, you know, off rip. You know, he's better than Amendola and Powell right now. Consistent route runner, um, open, very available, you know. But I think what the Lions want to do is kind of scale it back a little bit, run the ball more, and then, you know, throw second. So, but, you know, Jordy Nelson is a veteran. If somebody go down, won't be mad at it, man. He still played good last year. I watched a little Oakland Raider games. I play fan, uh, daily fantasy uh, sports. I play FanDuel, sometimes DraftKings. So he still got it. He still can catch. Um, still a formidable guy out there. Uh, maybe New York Giants looking for another outside receiver. They just picked up Golden Tate yesterday. And he's more of an inside guy. He can play a little outside too. So he could be in play. Maybe Cleveland might be in play with him. They got a young receiver. Um, forget the guy. But he couldn't catch last year. I forget his name. But they still got Juice. They still got Odell. They can use a, a Jordy Nelson. You know what I'm saying? So there's some teams that can use the services. He's still good. And he may can help the Lions out if somebody fall off. Or they just still they get a deal they can't refuse for Marvin Jones. They need some insurance. You know, Jordy Nelson could be that guy. But I hopefully don't trade Marvin Jones. I meant to get around to that video. Um, Again, I did it before. But I want to kind of re, you know, redo it. But. We'll see. Cheap, cheap guy. Um, and in his career, he probably won't go somewhere he want to win. So, you know, to be honest, I wouldn't be surprised if he didn't end up in New England. Um, possibly may end up in L.A. Could end up with Kansas City. So, I think those are some landing spots for him. Especially with Cooper Cup with the knee injury. He still ain't going to recover in a while. So, he can help the Rams. But as more as Sports Talk, let me know what you guys think about Jordy Nelson. No, he's a pack rival. Don't forget, well, he used to be a pack rival. We're on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Reach out to the email. If you've got business questions, the card response, your video requests. Want to check out my channel for more sports and music entertainment and current news. Goodfellow Sports TV is the name. Check it out. One time for the one time. Murder Street Sports Talk. But this your boy CJ Goodfellow. Love to hear your guys' opinion on Jordy Nelson. Let me know what you guys think. We gone.